Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the stream. Payne's Toy Samples is here. Good morning, my friend. Bat Stan has arrived. Lunk in Legoland Hyrule Building School. Well, you're not wrong there. You're not wrong there. That's what we're going to call this. I got a pretty, pretty sweet surprise. So I I was checking out the um, what the Amiibos do for this. And... Um, the one I really wanted to get was Epona. And Epona you can get through the original, the very first Link Amiibo from Smash Brothers. So I thought, what the heck? Let's drop it down. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Epona. Thank you very much. First try, first drop. I'm ecstatic. What a way to start off the stream. I'm so excited. So we're going to go stable her. Epona is a girl, I believe. I always thought that she was. So we're going to uh, go stable her. There she is. We need a saddle for her. Uh, so the amiibo drops. Uh, they're all pretty random. I mean, each amiibo has a set number of things, but it's like a lottery system. and You can only try each amiibo once. Every 24 hours. Uh, so we got super lucky. Where's the stable? Yeah, we're going to drop a pin there and stable her just so we do not lose her. Oh, she has four spurs right off the bat. Well, then. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, boy. Uh, she controls much better. <laughs> I'll say that. This is like the sports car. No offense, Bullseye. You're a great horse. However, I mean, come on. It's a Pona. Welcome, Jeff. What's going on? Let's follow that road. Easy, easy. It's okay. You're good. You're good. Following this road to the stable, again, right now, this is the only stable that we've uncovered. So that's why I'm running all the way back here. But I don't want to don't wanna lose her. I, I think she might be mine regardless, but I think if I lose her before I stable her, I'll have to try my luck with the amiibo again. And considering it's once every 24 hours, I don't like the odds. So... Stable condition. I like that. I like that. We will make sure she's in stable condition. Bat stand with the wisecracks on the Sunday morning, ladies and gentlemen. It was a really fun um, video we watched. The perfect dark one. Really wish... Uh, really wish that Nintendo would get their, uh, or Rare, I should say, not Nintendo. Rare would get their stuff together. What's going on here? See, distracted. Distracted. Hmm. I haven't seen three fall like that before. 
I'm gonna mark that. Let me come back to this. I'm gonna try something here. Okay, easy, easy. Uh, there are blocks falling from the sky area. They're constantly falling. But I saw someone do something really cool in a video. Actually, my buddy sent it to me. I want to try it out. One pony point. Yes. This is a pona. The horse of legend. I didn't say I wanted to rename the horse, did I? Let's board her for now. I want to check out those blocks that fell. We got a report of some blocks falling from the sky. We're going to check it out. Ah. All right. We're off. <coughs> What's going on, Cutthroat? Welcome back. Hmm. Well, I'm going to try something here. I don't know how this is going to work. What's going to happen to us? But we're going to try something. I saw this. And I must admit, I never thought of doing this. But I'm going to try reversing time to this here because this should take us all the way back up so once again in the words of the mighty Captain Kirk may fortune favor the foolish nope that didn't work hmm oh it did work It's pretty freaky. I don't know if this will get us to the top, but we're going to try. By God, we're going to try. Okay, that worked. There's a big dragon there. Um, so I saw that on a video. We reversed time to one of the falling rocks, and that got us up here. This is, uh, let's get this before we get hit. God. A Zonai charge with massive energy stored within. Put it in the Zonai device dispenser. You can use it temporarily. A Zonai energy cell before losing power. Cool. Zonai charge with massive energy stored within. Put it in the Zonai device dispenser. Which is what? This thing, right? Do I add it to this? Okay, right now we got to worry about this dragon coming to get me. We're definitely going to switch weapons here. Do I have anything that shoots? I don't believe so. This guy, for some reason, wants to kill me. I just want two seconds to kind of survey the land. No arrows. That hurt. Okay, I don't think there's anything around here. 
You're gonna have to swipe at this guy when he comes back. You guys know I like my uh, peace. I just want to just chill here for a second. This guy is not going to give me the opportunity. And I don't have any arrows, unfortunately. And yeah, I don't have my boomerang. Maybe he's going to leave. Okay. Anyway, let's look around. There's nothing up here. So every single rock that falls from the sky now, we're going to investigate. Not right away. Because that will take us to a different place in the sky here. Kill it? Okay, if he comes around. I don't know where he is. There he is. Come on. Yeah, he's he's gonna take forever. All right, well, here we go. Hey, there's a chest on top of this thing. Sidetracked already. Cool. Let's see what's in this. Two chests right off the bat. Not a bad start. Sapphire. No, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> yeah, whatever. All right. Back to Tilted Towers we go. Uh, I don't think you can capture that one. I don't know for certain, but... Uh, I need apples for the horses. So we're just going to search around here a little bit. But I have an idea of where we're going to go today. We're going to go main questing. And because we're kind of stuck on the Zora area right now. What we're going to do is... Um, the regional phenomenon is the first quest. So all seven streams, if you can believe it or not. We've just gone to the Zora area. So I think we're going to head... Uh, we almost have the northwestern point checked out, but I might actually do the northeastern-ish one and go examine that and see where that leads us. The sky bridge, what? Sorry, what about the sky bridge? I'm looking for apples, which are Cutthroat's favorite food in this game. Remember the first stream? Get the apple, get the apple. Well, it turns out he was right. Because the horses love the apples. Gotcha. Oh, I'm sure there's pear trees. We've only just scratched the surface, right? There's different regions, different climates. I'm sure there'll be pears. If there's apples, there's got to be pears. The legendary Apona. Hmm. 
All right, we'll take Bullseye into our care. That's cool. Let me explain in one sec here when we get the screen up. So I have two horses now. I have Epona and Bullseye. And Bullseye, we left somewhere on the map safely. But we left her there. And because I take out the other horse, the previous horse I already had out gets put into stable. Remember, we weren't sure if we were just going to completely lose that horse. But I think the only risk of losing it is if you don't stable it. So when you get a new horse that you want, stable it. That's the only way to for sure save it. Oh, you made a diamond spear. That's cool. You robbed Lady J. I'm sure she won't mind. I've heard about the Zora Domain. There she is. So I think, yeah. I think let's go here. We're going to ride to here and see what adventures... Wait for us along the way. Main quest style. Dude, I'm pretty sure there's... I mean, I don't know for certain, but I'm pretty sure there's more than just horses that you can ride in this. Uh, Breath of the Wild had more than just horses. Whether you could keep them or not, I don't know. Oh my god, a Pona rides like a friggin' dream. It's like... The super sports car of horses. Once again, I gotta say, I love you, Nintendo. Like, Amiibos that we bought in, what, 2011, 2012, whenever they first came out, I can't remember. Still have value? Like, that's incredible to me. Why don't more companies just flat out copy Nintendo as far as quality goes? We are headed towards the mountains, it looks like. So I'm guessing this is going to be Goron territory. Look how beautiful that looks. We're on our way, guys. Who's Farty Pants? Was that Bullseye? Was that his alternate name? Party pants? I can't remember. Is that what we named him? Oh no, that was the third horse, right? That we didn't keep. Yeah. I think that was the third one. We got a sign. Oh, yeah, you got to Z target it. I forgot. Whoa. Let's see where we're going here. Hyrule Ridge, Zora's Domain. Okay, well, we want to go to Hyrule Ridge. Okay, okay thank you very much. Okay. All right, opponent, let's go. Let's go. Good girl. Good girl. Bill, maybe. Yeah. Oh, this guy again. Should we help this guy? It's it's our friend, the sign guy. Look at this build. All right. Whoa. Stay. Yeah, Nintendo's earned their position too as far as like we'll make a Zelda game every seven years or whatever it is. You know what I mean? 
But if companies would just like hold off, man, I mean, I understand. I understand it's a competitive business and it's about the money. I get that. I do. I don't know. It's just. It's just really sad to see, I mean, the state of gaming. There's just a handful of companies, in my opinion, that are really just crushing it. It never used to be that way. There used to be so many companies making great games all the time. Now, is this one of those ones that... Try something different here. Jeff, did you see what I did with the, the stone that fell? Have you tried that yet? The stones that fall from the sky, jumping on them and reversing time. I, yeah, man, I don't think I ever would have thought of that. Wow. Up until this point, I didn't think of that. Yeah, I wouldn't care, Cutthroat, except I'm pretty sure we're going to get some kind of reward. I keep saying that. I don't know for certain. But I think we're going to get some kind of reward for helping him. And if it's unlocking more building materials, because the, some of the crazy things I've seen that people are building, they're getting the materials from somewhere. Whether it's just through natural progression of the story or what, I don't know. But there's there's always a reason to things in Zelda. This guy's not just standing here for no reason. Uh, and it's kind of fun. Yeah, I just saw that this morning. That's why we just tried that. Again, it, that wasn't my idea. I think if we blocked him in he really got mad last time ah well it's either gonna work or it's not gonna work <laughs> Build a, he's got and you know what he can use this as a nice little house afterwards I mean, it's not the nicest looking build, but hey, cares. Yep. Well, yeah, the master sort of course will be in this. Yeah, that's um interesting. Hey, it's a Goron. Oh, sorry, buddy. See ya. Oh, he's scared. Don't be scared, buddy. I love the Gorons. We're heading towards your area. Can I even get to this guy now? Yeah, I'm the worst builder. Some of this stuff people have built. Giant tanks, giant mechs. Uh, like spring coiled shocks and stuff like that. Like obviously there's stuff that we have to unlock, right? We have the bare minimum. We have wood. So I'm guessing, again not reading too much into this but i'm guessing through stuff like this the more we do the more we're gonna unlock that's why i keep doing these little builds here please 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 oh wow oh yeah that, i guess that was pretty dumb wasn't it that one didn't work I think we're going to have to do just something simple. I want to talk to the Goron here first. Shiny. Hey, buddy. Wow, look at this guy. Ooh, the Foothill Stables around here. Lots of hot springs are bubbling up near Foothill Stable to the east. Visiting hot springs every day is good for you. That's what they say anyway. All right, buddy. Good to see you. I talk to them like they're old friends. 
Uh, yeah, I think we just gotta maybe simplify the build. But you can't stick anything to the actual sign. That's just gonna fall. That's just gonna fall. What am I thinking? Okay, just drop it. Don't be scared. It's just the ultra hand. Golly. I mean, maybe something as simple as that is enough. And then we'll put another one. Let's shake that loose. Just put another one here. Do you know what I mean? Do you think? Drop it on the ground. Okay, it's on the ground. I don't know. Uh, probably not, right? Yeah, probably not. Because the weight. Okay. No, I know, but the weight... Look at the top of it, right? So this thing is literally just on a spike. So when he lets go, the gravity, because of the top of the weight, is going to make it fall. So I'm just putting a base so I could support it with these beams here. Uh, it's, it's tough. I like, this, I like figuring out these puzzles. They're neat. See what I mean? So if we do this, yeah, it's not gonna work. Uh oh! Oh god! Oh god! It's she's coming apart. Okay. Uh, I mean, <laughs> I think the guy's dead. Look at him. I think I just crushed his hands. I didn't mean to. We got this. We got this. Couple more of these and we'll be in good shape. Ow. Uh, okay. Just got it right here. Where's the sign? I don't know here. That's not working. Look at this magic board. Okay, then we're just going to try fashioning a log. I don't know. We'll just try it, and then we're going to move on. Let's just hope. Here we go. It's not going to count. Oh, did it count? It counted. Oh, my God. That's the worst job I've done, and it counted. Barely, barely. Okay, well, give me the cash. Give me the rice balls. Alright, back to Opona. That's pretty good. It's pretty good. Not really, it was actually terrible. I'm really surprised that worked. That shouldn't have worked. 
but it did. Let's go, girl. Get this thing out of here. Oh god, I hit a Pona. Oh my god. Wow, she's really gone. I dropped the plank on her. It's just, you'll be fine here. Do we have any apples? We'll give her an apple. She's so temperamental. Like, if you drop wood on her head, she doesn't like that. Like, come on, man. It's just wood. You're fine. Here you go. Eat this. Oh, I see how we're doing this. I'm just I'm just fine. She's fine. We're all fine now. How are you? That was a good build. That balloon over there. Hey, look at this horsies. Hey, horsies. What is that thing? Well, the Gorons are going to be a climb. So, I'm almost wondering if we should try and open up that map. Putting up the map, we go over here, maybe? There's that tower way over here. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, God. Octorok. Go. Oh, this is a stable. Let's go here first. Cool. Nice. Now we know a couple. All right, let's board a Pona. Oh, I got a reward for pony points. Yeah, let's register. Board horse. Board opponent. We're going on foot, guys. Death Mountain is done erupting. Yep. We're going to need, um, what, cold, hot, hot resistance now. Heat resistance, I should say. Uh, that goblin came up from behind me, and I swung at him and hit the horse, too. In Goron City, but hasn't come back. Okay, we need to go to Goron City to get fire resistant clothes, but we're going to get our pony points reward, which is what? Here we go. Is the horse guide uh, make sure mystical message? It's a very popular choice among our customers. If you save up three more pony points, you can register an additional horse. Cool. I'm going to sell some stuff here.
Clear out some of this junk that we got. Let's empty the bags. What is this? Opal. I'll save. Hot peppers we're going to save. This is for health. Elixir ingredients. That's the ancient rare fish. We're going to get rid of this. Wow, good job there, buddy. Glowing cave fish. I mean, and these frogs, like, we can't make anything out of them. Is that Mario? I actually shouldn't be selling the fish. I should be cooking the fish. I'm really surprised, actually, our wallet can carry this many rupees. Hoo-hoo! <laughs> hoo <laughs> What's this stupid thing? Moblin horn! Sell it! Okay! yee <laughs> I think everyone is just chilling, man. Yeah. It's Sunday. It's a day of rest, right? <laughs> Everyone's just chilling, doing their thing. What is this? Sapphire. Precious blue ore mine of natural rock. I'm going to keep that. Well, not for me either, buddy. Most people, Sunday is a chill day. Probably just chilling, hanging out. Okay, so we get a we can get a towing harness. Hey, I actually have a towing harness. I just don't know how to make a wagon yet. <clears throat> yeah, I mean I was gonna stream at three, which is the normal Sunday time now, but because the Foo Fighters concert's at three, yeah, I'll be watching that for sure. So that's why I started at ten. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. I'm sure you're going to watch it, too. Hey, doggy. Hey, buddy. We're just preparing for the trip ahead. Death Mountain. I mean, it's called Death Mountain. No... Friggin' Zelda game is Death Mountain ever fun or easy. <laughs> Yeehaw! Energizing Shroom Skewer. What else can we make? Oh boy, I threw them on the ground. And what are these? Chill shrooms. Okay, well, let's see what these do. I can't cook those. Hmm. Oh, the fire's out. Oh, it's raining. <laughs> Duh. Okay, there's a well here. There's too much going on. We got to focus. Let's focus. What's this thing? Oh, you can't focus. It's literally every two steps there's something to do. It's so good. What in the heck is this? Ah. 
Oh my goodness. Hmm. Who's this creepy guy? Oh my god. Colton. Oh, guys, it's okay. I'll do it for you, whatever it is. What are you talking about? Hunt for bubble gems. This guy have a quest too? Or is this the guy? <laughs> oh, I've seen those. They're pretty hard to catch, but I f we could do it. Here, take this. I already had one. There you go. That was easy. Oh, wow. Look at this thing. What is this we got? Bokoblin mask. Keep it to blend in with Pokoblins. No friggin' way. That's so wicked. More, I need more of them. Well, do I have any more? I'll give you whatever I got. I just keep giving me them sweet masks. I don't even know where I got them. I, I, I apparently had them on me. Huh. Oh, he'll be gone now. There he goes. Oh, cool. So he'll be throughout the map. Visit me in Terrytown. Oh, those big blue frogs. Okay, so we've got a bunch of those, actually. I hit a few of those, like, the first couple streams. The search for Colton. We even want to see this thing? Here we go. Ah, uh, look out, ladies and gentlemen. It is me, Link. I mean, that's pretty cool. Because you can sneak around the Bokoblins. I like that. It's got a function. We'll 
We'll be able to sneak into their areas and slaughter them. Ooh, shiny. We're going to enter that cave. I just saw something shiny here, so I can't help myself. <laughs> We're going to the Goron City. That is the um, the destination. But I just saw this little ledge here. There's nothing on it. Nope. Okay. Through the cave. So the red the red marker on the mini map. Here we go. I don't know if this goes all the way through, but we're going to explore it anyway. Oh, we have no arrows. Damn it. Well... I wonder if I can shoot him. Guess not. Yeah, these guys are something we need to kill, but I don't have any arrows. That's crazy. I have no arrows. So be it, Jedi. We'll have to come back. I have no boomerang anymore either. All right. I mean, I don't know if there's a pathway or not. Try and climb it. You can see how far we can get up here. Pretty steep. <laughs> Try and shoot through it. No, it's not going to work. Okay. Well, I'm sure that there's a path. There's actually the tower that we saw over there we can go to that that might be actually a better better thing to do to kind of uncover the map to see what we're working with here or maybe just go over this short little bump here there that's a little better that's better there's our tower Mm, there's a shrine. So much to do. So much to do. I almost want to do that shrine because we don't have any fast travel in this area. Oh, let's test this out. Let's test out this uh, mask we just got. The trees still want to kill me. That guy, how did he spot me? Well, that's not nice.
Let's do the shrine here. Uh, just to get the point. I really feel like one of the first things that should be done is not uncovering the entire map, but I think a lot of it is a smart thing to do. Hey, Elise. Good. We're just exploring parts of the map still. How are you doing? Rise and fall. Take this ridiculous Bogoblin helmet off. Just drawing. Nice. What are you drawing? You can draw Link if you don't mind. Try the time reversal. Can I work on that thing. This thing. Oh, I gotta send it back all the way. Oh, never mind. Oh, that was close. Sweet. Well, I'll get you a. a Good pick of the new link. Yeah, Elise is a fantastic artist. Fantastic. She did a great Majora's Mask painting that I have in the office here. And some Don't Starve gaming stuff, which is really great. Lots of stuff, actually. A couple Foo Fighters ones, some Daredevil stuff. Why is it so slow? Oh, boy. There we go. I know there's a chest right over here, but... Should we go get that? Yeah, let's go get that. You can tell you put a lot of time and effort into it, 100%. 100%. Let's drop this one. Pick up this one. I'm going to save this Zora shield. Um, so let's equip that new one. <laughs> little, this little guy. Oh, there you go. It's an energy shield. Okay. It's going to say little dinky shield. Little, uh, little dinker there. We're going to reverse time again on this block. I said... Oh, wrong one. We're going to reverse time on this block. Oh, it's wicked cutthroat. I didn't know you had a son. There you go. That's wicked, man. This here. Okay, well, let's step on this and see what happens. Oh, 13. That's great, dude. What did that do? OK. 
Okay, let's put that up. Oh, that's just that, that dropping there. Yeah, Jeff, well, um, obviously we'll get to see who the, the new drummer is. Um, I'm guessing, obviously, it's a permanent replacement. But Dave's kept it quiet. A lot of speculation. I mean, I, I obviously trust his judgment. It's If Dave thinks you're, you're good enough to be in the Foo Fighters, like, I have no doubt the drummer's going to be incredible. That's not even a question. Hmm. Okay. Well, we're going for a ride. In the words of Short Round. Hold on, lady. We're going for a ride. Didn't make it. That didn't work. Oh, God. Well, I'll see ya. <laughs> Gotta run? Okay. That's an idea. Maybe I just didn't go high enough with that. That could be possible. So watch, this will launch it in the air. Oh, I just didn't go high enough. Yeah. You're right, though, Cutthroat. I'm going to have to do a running jump at it for sure. So reverse time here. And just be patient. There we go. Good job, guys. Yeah, dude, Taylor was incredible. One of a kind. I remember um, just, they've been my favorite, obviously, from the beginning. And I got to see Foo Fighters with William on drums way back in 96. And it was all sad when William left. And I remember hearing that the drummer from Alanis Morissette was taking over. And it was so different visually. Right? So the last video I think we got... What we get? I'll stick around in Big Me. I think we're the only videos off the first record. And then a couple of years pass. Well, one year passes. And we get the Monkey Wrench video. And two huge things were in this video right off the bat. Dave had short hair. Like Luke Skywalker looking hair. And he had a, like a f goatee. And then you had Taylor in the back who stuck out like a sore thumb because he had bleach blonde hair. It was just so like, it was amazing. But I'm like, oh my God, it's so different. He's such a different drummer than William too. Matt Sorum? Mm, nope. <laughs> Not a big fan. I, I like Steve Adler way better. I think Adler's a way better drummer. Sorum's obviously talented, man. There's no doubt about that. But I don't know. It's going to be cool to see whoever it is. It could be a million. I My vote was for Shane Hawkins, for Taylor's son, who played at the Taylor Hawkins tribute last summer. But he's just too young. I think he's like 16, 17. And to tour around the world, it's just... Yeah, I don't know. I, I would like to see him. I think that would make the most sense. He did a great job on My Hero. I think he played something else too. I can't remember. Okay, that that was good. That was a good shrine. Completed that. Anyway, Cutthroat, that live event's at 3 p.m. Just check out Foo Fighters on any of their social media and it'll give you a link. It's a free, a free show that's live. So it's 3 p.m. my time. So it's what? Noon your time? Um, okay. Yeah. So now we have that um, fast travel point open, which is really important if we're heading into the Goron area. 
And again, let's explore. We don't know how to get to the Goron City. Uh, there's a pathway here, which looks like it's going to lead us to the tower, which I'd also like to actually do. So that we uh, open up this portion of the map. We'll have to see what awaits for us. You know, guys, when we see something shiny, I'm usually drawn to it. See, there's another block. Oh, I'm going there. I'm going there right now, shiny. Now that we know we can reverse time, these blocks are going to take us to different parts of the sky. We're going. We're going for a ride. Hold on. Hold on. We're going for a ride. Here we are. There's a chest right here. Okay, Jeff, what is this? Zone I charge energy boost. Um, is this something that I permanently add to my battery, do you know? Or is this something that I just use to refill the battery as I'm traveling? Do you know what this is? And this actually gives us a really great view. So let's just take a look here. Which way are we facing? Okay, oh my god, we have so far to go. Look at the mountains. Death Mountain, there it is. How many times have we gone into Death Mountain in Zelda? Many. The hardest, the most difficult, the scariest, maybe Zelda 2 Death Mountain. Temporarily full charge on a dead battery. Okay, so it's just a disposable. Uh, and there's our tower. Uh, we're going to get to the Goron City. We're going to head there, guys. But I think since we're so close to this and uncovering the map i think it's important that we do that plus i just want to do this cheers let's head there a la Fortnite. to be very careful with our stamina here because we could kill ourselves ladies and gentlemen ghetto finger gaming has arrived good morning my brother what's going on Is our tower. How you doing, dude? Yeah, it's easy, right? Cutthroat. It was so easy. I'm like, oh, we got to sign up for an account on this thing and do this and that. No, it li literally takes two seconds. It's awesome. I can't wait. Oh, yeah, on your first cup. Nice, dude. I'm my third. I'm doing good, brother. Good to see you. Uh, we're heading to the Goron Village. Oh, look how friggin' beautiful that is. It's unbelievable. We discovered a new ability too. So these rocks that fall from the sky, we can jump on them when they land and actually reverse time to go back in this guy. Uh. Yes, I did. Uh. What? Oh no. Uh. Oh no. Knocked off the lid that covers the hole. Well, we can just reverse that. Oh. Nah, we can reverse this. Watch this. Oh, no, not that one. No, stop it. Stop it. This thing. Did that not work?
No, stay on it. Stay. Well, I guess it has to be something that's been in motion already. Can we climb it old school style? Like Breath of the Wild? I don't think that we can. Let's see what he says again. A lot of ruins have fallen around this area. Really dangerous. Always a good idea to keep your eye on the sky here. Just in case. Ruins plop right around here. Oh, we can still go in. Oh, no, we can't. The door is broken and won't open. Let's see. Maybe if you use the terminal inside, that will force the back door to open. But without a way to get inside, we're kind of stuck. Hey, Dale, your name is Error. <laughs> Good to see you, buddy. Wait a minute, I got an idea. I got an idea. So we're gonna... There's rocks here that have fallen. I think we're gonna ride one. I gotta find one that just fell, right? And then we're gonna ride that up to the sky and then maybe dive in. If we can find one. Because I don't think we're going to be able to climb that. Oh, there's a rock. Falling right now. Look at that one. We're going to get that one right there. Yep. Oh, what is that? Shiny. Focus. Focus. Okay. Here we go. will take us up here then we're gonna dive into the tower still don't like heights <sighs> okay cool a long sword Where's the tower? Oh, only one way to find out. There it is. I mean, is this even going to work? Do I even know what I'm doing? I don't. Oh, God. Holy God. That was crazy. Holy cow. Well, we're inside. Oh. Worked, I think. Oh. I like how you can't just go to the tower the, f the first couple, maybe you can just go to and activate, but as you progress through the game, you have to figure out ways to activate them. Ah. And there's probably, you know what, there's probably a couple of different ways to do that, too. All right, let's activate the map. Here we go. Whoa. Whoa. There's a shrine over there.
It is scary. The Disney-ish music makes you feel more comfortable, though. Here we go. Death Mountain. Oh, I friggin' love it. So cool. But right now... I wonder if I can hit that shrine. Ah, oh, it's way too far. It's way too far. Hey, what is this? Shiny. Come on. Just trying to have a nice day with everybody. And you just got to come in there and be a nuisance. Well, now you're going to get it. Sword of Omens, come to my hand. D -d 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 oh, yeah, I don't have a shield up. You big bully. Ooh. Destroyed. What is that? Now ah, we're going to make it into something. Let's turn it into this. Woo! Soldier construct to horn. Yeah. Yeah. Take that bow. Thank you very much. Guys, this is our new summer home. What do you think? We live in the sky now. Do you like it? I like it. I mean, we got quite a view. Oh, my God. Does that not make you queasy? Oh, that makes me queasy. Woo. <laughs> Look at that. <gasps> hey, we can make a cart to get over to this area. Remember how we were going to go to Death Mountain? Sick. Look at this thing we made. Arrow. Yes. Okay, where are we in the sky here? I'm just trying to tell if this area we're going to try and go to up here. Is this somewhere we've been? Oh my god, these tracks really make me nervous. By the way, Cutthroat, Jeff was saying too that uh, you can get a house in this game. You decorate it and all that stuff. So that's going to be fun too when we get to that part. Where is Death Mountain? Um, okay, so we're in the sky now. So, oops. The sky world. Uh, let me show you. So if we hit the map... Okay, this is high this is the sky where we're in. We don't have a lot of it mapped out. There's Hyrule. There's Death Mountain. So this is where we are here. And Death Mountain is here. But before we get to Death Mountain, we want to go to the Goron City. Right? It's Goron Hot Springs. Yeah, so the regional phenomenon, the quest that we started, <laughs> the beginning of this stream is here. I know you want to build a house. We'll get there. Don't worry. We'll get there. Uh, but I think it's very important to uncover these parts of the map. So we kind of know what we're dealing with.
I'm just checking around here before we shoot across with this cart. Oh, I don't want to fall. Oh. Oh, easy. Oh, God. Oh, I feel sick. Uh, I feel sick. Get me back on the island. Oh. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm stalling here, so let's go. We haven't done this in a while. Look at the sunset. Oh, my God, it's amazing. Okay. We're going to attach one of these extra batteries to it. Might as well put both of them on. It's cool, right? And this was one of the first things we did the first day. Because we're just in the sky here. And it's so awesome. This is going to be great. Alright. Let's uh, not destroy the cart with a double hander. I mean, we can go super fast. <laughs> if we want to get all jackassy. I mean, might as well. Just a little bit. I love how I think I'm so clever, but like literally the stuff I've seen people make is just insane. Tanks and jeeps and mobile like mechs. Oops. But there's got to be like plans that you learn to do that stuff or I don't know how they're going to do it. But All right. Are we ready? We're going to go over there. This is the uh, this is the plan. Ready? No, I got I got them on the wrong way again. Oh dang, I got them on the wrong way. My bad. My bad. My bad. Whoa, 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 whoa. For whatever reason. I, I cannot get the fans the right way. Since day one, just shake it a little bit. I've had a hell of a time remembering it goes like this. Let's put that extra battery just in case. I think we're going to have enough juice to get there, but why not? We've got to have enough track to get to 88 miles per hour. Are we on the track? Yeah. All right. Here we go. We're off. See ya, buddy. Ooh, we fell. That's scary. So what's up here? Well, we're going to find out. Let me just check out the surface again. I don't really see anything down here. This 
This is as good a spot as any, I suppose. Let's get to the top of this mountain. Interesting. So, no, no, I don't want that. Where are we on the map here? We've once again stumbled upon just like this brand new area. We use a rusted claymore to. Hey, what's behind here? Really? Oh, we need fire. Okay. New is good, I agree. Uh, I think I can just pick this up, can I? Let's defuse this stick. Um, actually, I want a one-hander. Everything I have is two hands, except this. It's almost destroyed. <laughs> Burn those branches away, like so. It's going to be something we can move. And we'll burn this area and this area. can't move that. I thought we were going to be able to move that stone tablet, but we can't. Okay, let's switch um, switch our weapons. Yeah, burn the branches here so we can go through here. And here. here yeah there's a robot yeah I see him hmm easy chest let's go Sage's will, a small stone believed to have belonged to a sage. Holding it in your hand, you can feel the remnants of a strong bond. Hmm. Interesting. I have no idea what this is. But we got one. We discovered yet again something new. Probably had machines that fight like they do in Skyrim. You know what, Dale? I wish I spent more time with Skyrim. I, I really didn't play it. Whoa. This guy's got an attitude. We got him. We got him. Yeah, I did um, a bit of Oblivion. But I never really got into Skyrim. I think at the time because I was playing WoW so much. We still have ours. Okay, let's try and get through here. And here, man, there's a lot just in this little tiny, like, 
area in the sky that we found. There's a shrine over there we can't really get to right now. This is going to make someone's day in Hyrule. Cheers! They're in the underground made by gnomes. Steam machines made with gold. That's cool, dude. That sounds so awesome. Are you still playing that? I've got to play Skyrim, period. I wouldn't say get back into it because I, I didn't even really... Like, I played it, but just for, I'd say, maybe an hour. Is Skyrim the one at the beginning that the dragon comes down into the town? Or is that Oblivion I'm thinking of? Okay, that was this floor. One more up. Let's see what's up here. Have we been here? I don't recognize this area. Let's go over here. Like the part of this map is uncovered here. There's a shrine. Yeah, we've got to try and get there. Hopefully there's an engine here. Or, sorry, a fan, I should say. There is. There's a couple. And a battery. Okay. We're going to go over there and do that shrine. Again, I can't stress enough how important it is to uncover as much travel points as you can. Especially ones in the sky. Because it's not really... I mean, I wouldn't say it's super difficult to get into the sky. You guys know what I'm trying to say. I don't know when we're going to be able to get up to this point again or even remember how. So if we could see a shrine that we can try and complete to get a fast travel back up to here, I think it's important we do that. So we're going to make the carts and travel across there. And the, there's the shrine. We see it right there. Right there. Every time my 17 year old comes in, he asks me to mute so he doesn't hear any spoilers. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I'm trying not to. Well, you know what? To be fair, um, you can let him know. That we really haven't done much story stuff. I mean, we really haven't. But I understand. Um, like I was saying, in my in my feed now, in my YouTube feed, it's just all, look what I built, look what I built, look at this thing, look at that thing. So it's something that I can't avoid anymore. I think we did a pretty good job avoiding it for the first week. But I certainly understand that. Tell him sorry. Oh, you got him in on Friday. What a nice dad. And you know what? See, I almost put it on backwards again. It, you know, how many hours have we put into this, guys? I'd say pushing 30, maybe more. It's the, uh, the game that keeps on giving. You want to talk about a game with replay value. I mentioned this briefly on the stream yesterday, too. I have nothing but admiration for speedrunners. But can you imagine trying to 
plot your route to not any percent this, but to 100% this on a speed run. <laughs> oh my god. Like, that's now what you're doing the rest of your life. That's a lot of work. Uh, where's that other battery cell? Just to be safe. Take what? There it is. <laughs> Tears and Red Dead 2. Jeez. I mean, that's a lifetime of gaming. I just imagine, man, when GTA 6 comes out. We're going for a ride. I cannot wait for Grand Theft Auto. Oh my god. Rockstar has had 10 years of development. Anyway, one step at a time. What is that? Oh, it's a gumball machine. Sweet. Now we gotta find materials to make a bridge. Oh god, I gotta really be careful here. You guys see any building materials? I'm trying to look. Like, can we jump that? You think we can jump that? Jump and glide over. Not from that point, but I think this. Do you think we can make it? I said sorry. Oh, well, I don't want to be the one who ruins Zelda for anybody. I mean, it's only been out a week, right? Yeah, Canadians. Canadians do that. Canadians say sorry a lot. Here we go. Uh, let's try it. <laughs> oh. We wouldn't have made that one, but we definitely made that one. Okay, there's the shrine. What's that? Oh, is that a launcher? That's going to launch us. Look at that thing. Watch. Okay. Um... I'm thinking here. Okay, I'm going to take a two-minute bathroom break. Okay, guys, give me uh, two seconds here. Be right back.
Okay, let's go down here. <coughs> Get some gumballs. Zonite charges. You have any of those? Oh, right here. These guys. Okay, here we go. Big money, big money, big money. Big money. Oh, we got a new one. What's this one? Big wheel. Oh, oh no. Powered zone device that wants to move. It's big, mean, it's a wheel. We got, like, Bigfoot wheels. <laughs> That's awesome. Something else. What else? A Solonite device that gushes water when struck. According to legend, Sky Island saw water shortages. More big wheels. Hydrant. Hydrant. Something else. Ooh, a battery. I mean, that's cool. Yeah, I mean, it's whatever we can think of, right? Definitely for... I, it probably works for the sludge, yeah. Oops, I don't want to do that. All right, here we go again. More hydrants, more fans, good stuff, okay. Yeah, I think the sludge, I don't know if it's in every area or it was just the Zora. Oh god, this look at this thing. That's scary. Very scary. What's going on, Zero? Good morning, my friend. Good to see ya. How was your night? Steak tacos. Okay, we're gonna try and clear this shrine to get the fast travel point. Nice, dude. Sound good for sure. Water makes a way. This is something new. Oh, it sounds so good. It's going to be too hot, I'm guessing. I don't, Does this, I, don't, I don't know anything about this hydrant. This is like brand new. So let me just see here. Oh, yeah, that's hot. That's hot.
I didn't know if that would move us or not. Okay, it doesn't do anything. We have to cool it down. Is that what we have to do? Oh god. Okay, hang on. Let's try this again. So I think we have to place them and then cool them down one by one to get across. think Try it on the lava? Okay. Let's try it on the lava. It just seems like a lot of lava for the, the hydrant. Maybe we just need to clear a path. I was trying to cool down each stone before jumping on it, but I accidentally dropped that one on the other, and it brought all the lava onto the first one. Okay, let me just go see if I can stand on this. Okay, so I can stand on this, no problem. We don't have to cool it down. But let's try your theory there. Cut through. Let's grab this and point it at the lava. See what it does. Interesting. That's so cool. Yeah, you're right, dude. Oh, we just hold it. Ah, okay. That's neat. There we go. So there's a chest here. Let's try and get there. Now I might be overcomplicating things. Oh, God. Oh, did it die? Did we lose the hydrant? We did. Okay. So, let's do this. I'm going to flip it. Because those kind of walls are slippery. I don't know if this is going to work. That's too heavy. No, nope, it worked. Chad's here. What's up, buddy? Good morning, my friend. Thanks, dude, for the super chat. The super Chad. I'm just going to call it a super Chad from now on. How was the show? Yeah, smash the likes. God. How you doing, brother? Hmm. 
Mega Chad. Drop this thing. I'm trying to fuse it with this, maybe. Okay, pull it out. No. Mo, oh, you're back. What's up, dude? You snuck right in there, buddy. Good to see ya. I'm trying to figure out how to get in this door. Gonna do anything? Fuck. No. Maybe we just need plain old bombs. Just the old bombs to get her out, maybe. Lava. Sure. Uh, how do we catch the lava, though? Yeah, neon at night tonight, baby. Do I have a vessel? I don't think it lets you use any of your gumballs in here. Oh, it will. Yeah. I think I should be able to use an arrow. I'm just going to use a bomb and see if that works. No, not not a mushroom, a bomb. <laughs> I mean, it worked, right? I don't think it had anything to do with the puzzle, but it worked. This time, however. Oh, this time. We don't want to go off this cliff. Oh. You want me to get the third one? We'll get it just in case. She want to shut it off. Fuck. This might be a bit tricky.
Well, I need to, uh, I don't know. Put it here. And then we're going to have to... Oh, it keeps... Oh, I just dropped it in the damn lava. Got a real build up here. We got her. Just gotta take our time here. Be super careful. Super careful. Oh god, no, it's not working. Alright, buddy. See you in a few minutes. So we can't even touch l the lava at all. I was going to say, I wonder if we could just, like, run and, like, out-health it or whatever. Hmm. Okay, so hang on. So if you have one going this way... Okay. That's doing a build up, so that should stop it. It's not enough. I'm not going quick enough, yeah. I don't I'm not too sure here. You have in brick and stick the walls. Wow, did we lose that hydrant too? We did all oh, respawn. Okay, I think that one facing this way is not going to do anything. So let's get this one to face here. I see what you're saying. So we'll do, like, just grab these, right? Oh, I gotcha. Instead of trying to run, instead of trying to outrun it, we'll just make... Ah, I gotcha. You could probably just make a bridge. That's a good idea. Try that. Good idea, dude. One's a little suspect.
just gonna measure right now. Oh god. Oh boy. Oh, that's more than enough. There we go. Perfect. Good afternoon, TJ. Welcome to the stream, dude. Chris, you are you are the smartest man alive. But that one was really important because I wanted to get that uh, warp point so we can come there, come back here anytime up into the sky. In this area. Instead of building the carts and all that to get there. Because there's that launcher. I'm sure that launcher is going to be something that we're really going to need. It's going to shoot us in the different directions. Places we haven't been yet, we're going to find out in like five seconds. Yeah, it's kind of cool. We're all learning together. And yeah, whenever or if ever you get this game, you're going to be like a pro at it. There was probably, again, five different ways we could have done that. I don't know. Who knows? But it's really great. really makes you think. Done. More point in the sky. Oh, good. You know what's great about this one? is there's a gumball machine right here. This one dispenses the big wheels. That's great, man. We're going to be able to make a kick-ass car. Yeah, we tried to outrun the lava rocks, but I don't think that we were making it in time. Like I think that the, the stream would have gone quicker than we could have ran across it. Let's check out what's down here. So where could this shoot us to? That one right there. Looks like it, right? Where else? Uh, I don't know how far this thing will shoot us. Oh, the red thing? I, yeah, I saw that too. I don't know what that is. This is where we jumped from, so we don't want to go there. We don't need any more of those gumballs at this present time. This thing will aim us. I think that's where we're going to go. Let me look on the map. Yeah. All right. Are we ready to launch? Oh, God. I moved it. Oh, God. That looks about right. Are we ready? Let's do this. Just to double check to make sure there's nothing around here. I mean, we can warp back here anyway, but. Here we go. Oh, God. Didn't even hurt. We live here now. Oh, I'm glad you're here, dude. You all done doing gardening? Yeah, I got to do some lawn work. In between this and the Foo Fighters concert. That's being streamed. So I hear you, buddy.
Okay, we're over here. Uh, I'm not too sure where here is. It doesn't look like there's much of anything on this island. Oh, <gasps> another shrine. Look. Oh, wait. No, that's the shrine we just came from. Never mind. That's where we just came from. Yeah, me too. Did you uh, did you sign up for it? I mean, it takes two seconds. Yeah, I think I have my browser open. I couldn't get it to. I couldn't get the browser to work on the PS5 though, so I'm gonna have to do it on my PC, I guess. Which is fine. Uh, 3 p.m. our time. Just go on to any of their social media. There will be a link. I think the thing's called Veep. It's totally free. You just got to claim your free ticket. It starts at 3. Okay, there's, no, there's nothing here. Um... We warp back. Is there another area that we want to get to? Yeah, I don't think there's anything else, guys, here. It's weird that there's nothing here. It's very suspect. Why would you launch me here? Hmm. That's there to the launcher. We'll travel back there, and then we're going to aim that launcher in another direction. I think there's a little tiny island we might be able to get to. Nice. How great is that, too, right? It's just free. They could have charged, too, and everyone would have bought tickets, but it's just free from their own studio from 606. Yep, that gumball machine. That's the cool one. So, Ghetto, we just got the big wheel tires from that one. We got big wheel tires and I think a battery uh, and the, uh, the hydrant. So each dispenser has different items, which is really cool. Uh, where's that other island I saw? That's way too far. I thought I saw another one. Oh, maybe not. I mean, yeah, there's this little one. Oh, that's it right there. Let's try that. What's that? What is that? Did you see that? Let me just see if I can angle the camera. Oh, they're not going to let me. See that on the side there? The bottom? Hmm. Okay, look at the screen. Yeah, there's like a it's like a target. I can't really get the camera to Oh, climb down. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, brave. Be brave. It's a Korok seed, isn't it? Yep. Sweet. Buddy, you're making me dizzy. Oh. Cool. Apple. 
apples. For a Pona. Oh my god, I almost fell. Oh god. Oh my god. Okay, we're gonna head to the Goron City if we can find it. Find out what direction it's in. Wow, where the heck are we? Wow, we're way out there. So our quest destination for regional phenomenon is right here. We're so high, we're higher than Death Mountain. Look at Death Mountain. This is the direction we need to go. So I guess... Is that a giant Goron? What is that? What the hell is that? Oh, that's creepy looking. Well, I guess we're going to find out. I know. Well, I think everybody wants to know who the new drummer is too, right? For Food Fighters. And instead of a boring old announcement, they're just going to do a show at their studio and we'll see. It's awesome. It's exciting. Okay. You guys ready? We're going down. Here we go. Wait, what is this? We just found another area. By accident. Well, I guess we're not going there yet. Oh, dude, I wish. I wish. <laughs> Mo, can you imagine how many people... Like, I don't, I don't even know who you get in contact with. Foo Fighters Management. There's that Death Star over there, by the way. How many people got in contact with whoever to say, hey, can I apply? Where can I apply? What can I do? And it's at this point, I don't know. Maybe they're going to try somebody completely new. But something tells me it's going to be someone who's already established. I, I don't know. I'm in the, into their career this far. But, dude, I wish. Dream job. Yeah, there's been a ton of names going around. We're just checking out this area. Yeah, those float. Yes, they do. Ooh, there's another one of those glyphs. Climb down. Are you crazy? All right. I'm not doing any hot air balloon stuff right now. Yeah, this is his baby. He's going to choose who he thinks is, is right. Again, if it was my choice, I would vote for Shane Hawkins. But I just, he's too young, I think. I, I don't know, man. I don't know what the rules are for that kind of thing. Like touring all around the world. I mean, you're not even old enough to get into a bar, right? Not to mention, like, is that good for a, a teenager? I, I don't know. I don't know. We'll find out, I guess. Stay on target, red.
Well, that kid's already set. Just because of who he is. I mean, he's, he's talented from what I've seen for sure, but he's already set. If he wants to be a professional musician, he's going to be, right? There's a shrine. Do you want to do that shrine? Oh, God, I'm going to die. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, it's going to be a fall. Okay, let's do it. Let's figure this one out. Let's not forget, this is going to upgrade Link overall. So when we eventually start the quests, I just think it's going to be better to have him beefed up just a little bit. Which one is this? What lies ahead? What lies ahead? This is the against the flow. Okay. Same thing as last time. Yeah, it's focusing on the water and the lava. I don't see anything else over. We jumped across there. That was pretty easy, and there's nothing over here. We got an enemy. Damn, all these two-handers I have. Let's use this one. So we got to put a ball in here. That yeah, that's true as Jeff as well. Yeah. It just makes me wonder, right? I know the album is going to be very personal, but that's clearly Dave on the drums on the record. So I don't know. Maybe the new drummer just wasn't ready in time. We'll find out in, I don't know, a couple hours, two hours, two and a half hours. All right, let's everyone use our brain power here. So we have to get across, and then we have to get that ball and put it in this hole here. Basketball style cutthroat, this is for you. Build a bridge again. Boom, look at that. We can do that. The answer to everything is build a bridge. You can't go wrong with building a bridge. I love this game, but I miss Resident Evil. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Oops, what I do there? I was going to do Resident Evil today, but I just... I, this is too good. I can't. Can't. <laughs> From the two songs I've heard, Jeff, so far, um, it's very old school Foo Fighters. And in my humble opinion, I believe that while well, this is overkill for the bridge, in my humble opinion, I believe that he did the majority of the writing. Everyone usually throws their hat in the ring for his approval, but I believe he did the majority of it. 
It sounds less collabby as the last two records have been. Hey, there's a chest there too. Well, we're gonna get that one. I mean, come on. All right, buddy. We'll be waiting for you. Yep, I'm building a bridge. I just don't want to tear apart that last one we just got. Plus, I think it's too big to turn. Oh, this this might tip us. We got to be careful here. Uh, room is definitely uh, an issue. Um, hang on. I just want to get one more. Ta -da. The sky follows here, ladies and gentlemen. All right, party can start now. What's going on, dude? What are you saying? Which one are we going to drop? Let's drop this one. Party time! We got a new shield. We got the ball. Jeez. Oh, God. And I am going to throw my thing by mistake. Get in there. Yoo-hoo! Oh, boy. Okay. More lava, more everything! We got fans, we got hydrants. To get up here, we're gonna do this. Actually, I think we can do this. Get up! Okay, two hydrants. Let's think. We have two hydrants and two fans. Well, it doesn't look like the flow is too crazy. We might be able to just... Do we want to go from up here? I don't think so. No. Got everything up here. Yeah. Build a lava boat. That's a good idea. Okay. 
Yeah, we're going to need both fans for this because unless I make a smaller chunk, this might be pretty heavy. I don't know. I've never used rocks for a boat. We're going to see. I put it on backwards again. Again, I put it on backwards. I don't know, the small side to me just looks like it should be the one. I know it's wrong, but... That? Yeah, the stone's going to be heavy. And... Well, this is the last challenge, so I don't think we're going to need the hydrants. I mean, we can bring one anyway. But I think it's just going to... Weigh down the boat. Oh. We have no steering, remember. It does look like the killer whale. That's the idea. That's why I keep building mine exactly the same every time. Let's just jump, man. Let's just jump. Oh, cool. I was in a hurry to go because I figured that it was going to uh, go under the bridge, but it didn't. Oh, easy. I don't think I want this thing. I think that's going to make it. That's a long haul. It's a long haul, guys. Right, here we go. We're going. We're rocking now. There we go. Good job, guys. Another shrine down. Yes, you did. More motes of light. Yeah, it was nice to do this one instead of a uh, one based on shapes. Stanley's back. Yep, yeah, we, uh, I think every hovercraft I've made, I've made it like the killer whale, which is funny. Just, I, I don't even mean to do it. It's just like a hovercraft. That's what I see. Ooh, shiny. What's that? Okay, well, that one's done. Goron Cliff, do you see Goron City anywhere? Goron Cove, Goron River. Well, I'm guessing it's the regional phenomenon. Duh, that's where the city's going to be right there. So we should go and get on this path here and follow it to the Goron City. Yeah, the lava ones have been my favorite too. I mean, we got to see what this is, right? Bedrock Bistro. Hey, we found the bar. Am 
Marbled rock roast is sold out here. Bedrock lawsuit. <laughs> Big bro, you always wanted to be part of the what? Uniboco. It sounds like old wino music. What are they getting drunk on barbecue? Listen to it. <laughs> That's so cool. I don't think you can. No, you can't take it. Looks a little strange, I know. <laughs> I love how they eat rocks. It's so great. Hey, I'll help you out. What's the problem? I've checked out the caves past the cart tracks, just like you told me. I couldn't get anything. Just seeing. Nothing up top here. All right, so let's head. Let's head there. So let's follow the path. Look at these canyons. Wow. Go mining. I think that's where we're going to be heading. So the Gorons are all about that stuff, right? So I'm sure there'll be some cart work and mining and side quests and, uh-oh, building. And, yeah, sea carts. It's boiling inside the cave. It'll be burnt to a crisp going in like that. The caves here have lava in them, so it's burning hot inside. You'll turn into dust unless you're a Goron. For Hylians like us, we have uh, something extra to protect ourselves. Fireproof lizards with monster parts make fireproof elixirs. I can't help you with the ingredients, but if you have them, feel free to use the pot over there to make what you need. Okay, so we need to find the ingredients to make fire elixir to get in here. Naturally, my first instinct is to completely ignore him and run in there anyway. But I don't want to get burned to a crisp. We've frozen to death before. There you go, Chris. They're hiring. We can become miners. Let's go. Let's friggin' go.
So we need to find the ingredients in order to... Well, we have a fire hydrant, but that's not going to help our flesh. I mean, see, we almost got sidetracked again. There's going to be a fire tunic. Just like there will be a cold weather tunic. Oh, I see. They're like all possessed by this stuff. Goron City straight ahead. The the uh, marble rock roast is making them all like nuts. Oh, I didn't mean to scare you guys. Uh... Well, we're on the right path, so it's just up here. This would be a lot quicker with the Pono, but come on. If you're traveling alone, I don't recommend it for Hylian especially. This might sound strange coming from a Goron, but you really ought to stay away from Goron City right now. Well, that's where they want me to go, so I'm going. He's been turning Hylians away from his bistro. Been slacking eating these weird rocks. Well, I'll solve the problem. Hopefully. Gotta go up here a bit more. Oh, wow, it's really far. Have you done this part yet, Jeff? Yeah, that's the place you go if you want fire resistant clothing, exactly. Yeah. You haven't? Wow. Okay. Again, there's no set there's no set path, right? It gives you the four areas in the main quest line and you get to go where you wanted. If we had a cart, we could go this way. Oh, buddy, I'm sorry. We don't have time right now. We don't have time right now. <laughs> Mr. Sign Guy is there, our buddy. So much stuff to explore. So many places to go. Uh-oh. Are these guys bad? They look like they're a little bit possessed. Uh. Uh. Okay, creepy guys. Link. Oh. I thought he was going to kill me. Look at their psychotic smiles. What do you guys want? What? Oh. Ah. 
minutes. So if you're loading up on ore, you should probably sell it before you're scammed out of it. We're good Gorons. We'll take it off your hands for a great price. About three rupees for all your ore. Wow, that's a really good deal. But I'd say no. Scam. They plung in Resident Evil, yeah. <laughs> Maybe nine will feature them. Well, did I almost get duped there? Well, not really, because you know, we didn't. Joker got them with a smilex. <laughs> now that Death Mountain's eruptions have stopped, the lava's cooled. I've been seeing more highly in travelers. Which is great. Mm. <laughs> I'm a jeweler in the Gerindo town in the southwest of Hyrule. Well, let's see. Do we have any of the Amber Dealer? Do we have any? Mm. See what she gives us if we have some. I'll buy 10 pieces of Amber for 200 rubies. Rupees, sorry. Mm. Oh, I don't have 10. Ah, I tried. That thing up there, like, uh, that's the vehicle, the transportation. Oh, look at that. That's what that was that we saw way up there. Look at that. We were way up there. Oh, it's making me dizzy. We were way up on that little island. And we used our camera. We zoomed in to this guy. Amazing. I think Link's just given up. Is this it? Goron City? Please no crying baby this time. It is. Like right now, dude, my head is like spinning. Like look at all this. Look at all this. Like, where do you even begin? Quest there. These guys are all possessed. Hey. There's the shop. Sweet. We need the fire resistant clothes. Although I'm, I have a feeling it's not going to be this easy. Is this it? Oh. Flame breaker. Armor created by Gorons for Hylians. Curious enough to visit Goron City. It's made from fire resistant rocks. 700? Oh, man. 700 buck. These are 1200? Oh, boy. And then the helmet is 1400. Oh, man. We're never going to get in. Son of a... Unless... I just take it. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, buddy. Give me a deal. Come on, man. All the money... Like, I don't think we've spent really any money. And I don't even have 700 bucks. That's not even enough for one of the pieces. And I'm sure we need pieces for every part. We need all three. Is that the helmet from Dead Space? Is it? <laughs> All right, uh, let's see what we got to sell. I mean, 
Let's try, right? It's at 3 p.m. our time, man. So two hours and like 10 minutes. Don't you worry. I mean, this stuff's eight bucks. Like, this stuff's not going to get us anything. Now, this is like 150. Do we keep this kind of stuff? I guess this are just the choices you need to make, right? That's worth 150. Well, I'm sure all this stuff has some kind of value in some degree in this game, right? I mean, some of it's vendor trash for sure, but... We still don't even have 700 yet. You're waiting in the chat room? Nice, dude. Is there lots of people talking? I'm assuming there is. Okay, I'm going to sell this, I guess. The sapphire, right? A precious blue ore mine from natural rock formation. Sapphires contain the very essence of ice. They're better known. Fetch high price. Like what are these? Opal. That's pretty good. I'm keeping that rare fish. So that was a quest item that we probably don't need anymore, but I'm going to keep it anyway. Uh, Moblin horns. A good thing about this game is that bag space is not an issue. It is for your actual weapon equipment, but... 500 for a diamond. Ooh, the most the most precious ore that can be found. When do we get a diamond? Signature sparkle has charmed Hyruleans for generations. As such, it is sold for a very high price. Um, I don't know about that diamond. Well, let's take a look. Okay, so we're going to need all three of these pieces for sure. So the tunic itself is 700, so we can get that. Then the helmet is fourteen hundred, and then the pants are twelve hundred. Now there's probably a couple ways. I'm sure these are quest rewards of some kind, but I don't think we're going to be able to do much here in Death Mountain without this stuff. Let's sell a few more items. What'd you say, buy my farty pants? Should I sell the diamond? I'm sure we can fuse it to a weapon. I think Jeff said he did that. But it's worth 500 bucks. I'm selling it. This blade, 10 bucks. 20 for an octopus. I've just picked up everything. What are these? These are bright bloom. Yeah, no, we're not selling those. Um, what is this? Fleet Lotus Seeds. I mean, I wonder if we're going to get like a garden when we get our house. Because all this stuff probably means something for that. Um, Black Bull Coblin Horn.
Ew, dirty old toenails. Well, those are worth quite a lot, actually. Forty buck. I'll take it. What is this? Boss Boblin Fang. Sixty buck. We have eighteen hundred. We're getting there. Oh boy. We're selling like everything we have. All the all the materials that we found. Uh these give us health. <sighs> Tough choices. Yeah, all he says is, ooh. Ah. No Jabba no bother. What's this here? Puffins. Flint, we need to start fires. Bundles of wood. Okay, um, let me think, let me think. Bright blue, we're going to keep. Luminous stone, mysterious mineral, gives off a pale blue glow. Apparently this stone can be used. Make special clothing. Well, we're going to keep that then. I'm sure there's a pattern somewhere to get the uh, fire resistant stuff. I'm doing it the very basic way here. We might have enough. I don't know. We'll have to see. At the very least, I know we're going to need all the pieces for it to actually work. Oh. Amber. No, we're not selling that because that lady will give us sweet cash for it. Grasshoppers. Two buck. Okay. Let's see how much we have. We have... My uh, logo is covering the price. What's that noise? What's going on? When the glow of the All this again. Moon shines upon the land. You would do that when I'm trying to do business here. Go away. Okay, big whoop. Okay, 700 buck. Bye. Well, I'm not a Goron, so I need this stuff. Oh. Yeah, I'll buy it. Oh. <sighs> Helmet. How much? Ugh. Oh. Yeah, I'll buy it. And how much is the final piece? So we got two of the pieces. Now we need the the pantalons. Those are twelve hundred buck. And we have one hundred and sixty four dollars. So let's see what else we can unload here. Oh. Buy my stuff. How much did I say? Twelve hundred is what we need. Uh, mushrooms we should keep for health. We're not getting rid of the zonite wildberry. I mean, I like like stone. I don't know what any of this stuff does. These are all for health. We're definitely gonna have to keep the health. That's pretty much what he's giving me for this stuff, man. Like, some of this stuff's not worth anything. Two buck for each acorn? I mean, it's just an acorn, right? You just run out on the road and get one, but...
Ruby. Well, we're getting rid of it. I know we could make some cool like weapons and stuff, but I really want to go in those caves. That's the amber, right? Topaz. No, this is... Oh, these are worth a lot. Okay. There we go. Getting there. We're about halfway there. This is... I only have one of those. Okay, I gotta go to the washroom again. Uh, give me a couple of minutes, guys. Two minutes, I'll be right back. We'll continue. I we're gonna get the pants, and then we're gonna go into the uh, the caves that are too hot for old Lonk here. Be right back. Yeah, luminous stone, is that something we should keep? Um, mysterious mineral gives off a pale blue glow, which some believe to be the souls of the dead. Ah, oh, it can be used to make special clothing, so I shouldn't sell it, but it's worth so much. Hmm. Uh. 
that's for health. I can't sell that. Shock fruit. Splash fruit. I might have to just I might have to just sell that. How much how much do we need? Twelve hundred, right? Oh yeah. I'm just going to get rid of it. Yeah, I did it. That's enough. I'm sure we can get it again. So, big pro tip, yeah. Pick up absolutely everything that you find in this game because you can sell it all. <laughs> There's fire resistant link. Da 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 da. He looks hilarious. Ah, <laughs> uh, the bozo music playing. Okay. In. General store, armor shop. Car on spice, cane, fire fruit, arrows, ooh. Football and gay. It looks like Gridiron. Captain Gridiron. <laughs> it's cool. I like how all the armors are completely different. It's really neat. So, I mean, where to go? 104. Down the hill, we're gonna go down the hill. I guess we're gonna go check out that cave. I mean, we didn't spend all this money on this armor for nothing. I wanna ride that thing. Yeah, we need arrows, but I'm not gonna spend my money on them. They haven't been really difficult to find. Get out of here. Iron Man Link. That's pretty good. I would say. I would agree. He looks like Iron Man Link. And ladies and gentlemen, we're not walking down there back to that cave like some sucker. What's this thing? Oh, just pots. Let's go. Yo! Yee-hee! 
to the bottom. Way faster. All right. Now, where was that cave? Southern mine. I think this is a different area. Yeah, there's going to be lots of minecart stuff in here. You can be sure of that. Oh, boy. No, this is a different path because we came down here. I think it was here, wasn't it? Trying to remember the the way we came. I don't remember there being any bad guys. Oh yeah. This way, right? Yeah. I think the cave is just to the left. And this is just for that little side quest, I believe. Oh god, what the hell was that? What is that? You! He's throwing dynamite at me! Okay. You wanna play that game? Let's play. No, not that game. Not that game. Another game. This game. Ah, uh -huh. hey. That's not what I wanted. I'm supposed to explode. Where was that cave? Still down a ways, I guess. I'm pretty sure we're supposed to go in that cave to get one of those rock sirloin thingies. Yes, this is the cooking area. This is the cave right in here. Okay, here we go. I don't think we've saved it all day. West Restaurant Cave. Wooden weapons and shields can catch fire. Whoa, look at that. I guess I won't be using any wooden uh, weapons in here. That's my bow that's on fire. Oh, and there it goes. <laughs> that's so cool. I thought my shield was gone too for a second. Okay, so we don't want to use any wood weapons. I mean, that makes sense, right? Okay. 
Hey, there's no rock sirloin things. That's what we we're supposed to grab, right? Cook says the marbled rock roast can be found in the caves. This is them right here. How are we going to get it over there? How am I going to get back over there? Well, I have... I actually have some of the hydrants. Okay. Yeah. Okay, well, we know where they are. They're right here. So let's go further into the cave. Oh, there's hydrants here all over here. Okay, great. Uh-oh. Rockets. I got an idea. I'm going to say it's going to be a good idea, but it might be an idea. Fuse it to this. <laughs> okay, let's put the rocket on the sirloin. need to get it over there I mean this should work right I just don't know how I'm going to balance it it's going to tip over I will right, see if it will go over there go did it make it <laughs> is it over there <laughs> hmm I mean, an easier way would be just just to make uh, like a raft with the hydrant. We can do that. Let's take this. Let's bring this down just in case. I don't think we need it, but let's do that. Down. Down. This is so rad. This is long enough. Like so, right? That'll work. And drop. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, shiny. Oh, look what I found. Look what I found. Damn it. Well, now you know we got to do this. Actually, I'm going to keep that one. So we're going to have to build two bridges anyway. we got to go get that frog. Oh, 
Uh, by the way, while we're playing, I mean, this far into the stream, I wanted to uh, dedicate this one to uh, Jacques. Um, Jacques wishes he could be here. He plans on returning soon. So this stream's dedicated to him. We miss you, buddy. I know you watch these replays, and I appreciate it. Hope you guys are doing good. Is that long enough? Do you think... Yeah, but those frogs... At the present time, because my mind's getting numb from doing all this, I can't remember what the frogs give you, but they're important. That I do know. Listen to the bozo music. Oh yeah, I forgot this thing's super heavy. I'm gonna just be gentle. Easy. Is that long enough? I guess we're gonna find out. Oh, my bow, that's right, my bow caught on fire. Dang. Look at this thing smoking. Uh, am I going to be able to pull this out in time? Oh, what? One hit dead. There we go. That was worth it. Well, let's mine some of this. What is this? Flint? Eh, whatever. We'll do it anyway. Okay. He kind of looks like a samurai. A little bit. Nah, he doesn't. He's like a medieval barbecue from G.I. Joe. Whoa! It's like, be careful, bozo music. Oh, what am I doing? I can just pick it up. Ultra hand forever. You're fired. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't die there. The last time I I died instantly. This reminds me of Majora's very much, this part. Is there no cart here? Come on, I don't want to walk this thing. There we go. There we go. Let's go. Oh, 
all that just to return this to him. <laughs> Save my bacon. Er, roast. There. That cost me like over $2,500 in armor, bud. Now that's a marbled rock roast. What do I get? What did I get for that? Or did I help out that guy? Oh, I helped that guy out. Okay. That's it? Why I keep thinking that I'm going to get something like the mirror shield or something that I got. Large Zonai charge. Ah. See ya, buddy. That was not worth it. Meat for meat. I mean... So I can... I'm assuming that's a... Quest you can do over and over again. I'm guessing. Ooh, you installed Perfect Dark. Nice, dude. Good stuff. Guys, I don't want to cut the stream, but I do. I have to, I should say. Um, got a few things to do before the uh, the Foo Fighters concert. So thank you, everyone, for joining me. Thank you for the super chats and for joining me on this hot, hot day in Hyrule. Hey, we got this cool armor, and we're in the Goron area now. It's been super fun. I will see you guys on the next stream. Thanks very much. Enjoy the concert, guys. Until next time, ciao.